Cornell Synchrotron is a particle accelerator stationed underneath the Cornell campus. Established in 1967, this facility helps us learn more about particles through the use of X-rays. X-rays are similar to visible light rays, as both rays are wave-like forms of electromagnetic energy that are carried by particles called photons. Visible light and X-ray photons are produced by moving electrons in an atom's nucleus. When an electron drops from one orbital, or level, to another level, it releases some extra energy, which is determined by the amount of levels dropped. The energy released is sent to an attracting atom, which can result in X-rays being presented or be seen as visible light. X-rays have the ability to penetrate certain forms of matter, such as skin. Other materials reflect the rays and thus give the image of those materials, such as bones in our bodies, or metals and other minerals. This is great for medical uses, allowing doctors to diagnose bone fractures easily. But what does this have to do with the synchrotron? The Cornell synchrotron is used to collect data concerning particles and how they work. So why use x-rays? X-rays are able to record matter down to the molecular level, allowing Cornell researchers to discover particle interactions at the lowest level of matter. This can further research in physics by allowing scientists to have a look at how the world around us works. To learn more about the synchrotron, please visit the Cornell Synchrotron source at www.chess.cornell.edu.